Christmas, everyone. Merry Christmas! Hi guys, I'm getting ready Tom for Thomas to start school after. It is nearly quarter to two. So we're gonna have a quick crumper. And then we are going to go straight to school to drop Thomas off there. Um, so yeah, hopefully he has a good day. Amy's got her last day in concert today. And of course, I hopefully she do really well today. But in the meantime, we're going to get Thomas to school. from nursery so I'm just gonna wait for him and uh, basically I'm gonna collect Amy. Yeah, I'm gonna do some food now what it is I'm gonna do chips out of homemade potatoes sausage as you can see in there and beans so you can watch me I'm gonna cut these into chips and then we're going to put them in the halogen cooker. Awesome, or what? I've just had a bath and I feel so refreshed, guys. Um, honestly, the bath done me good. So I'm going to be working tomorrow, uh, Friday and Saturday, and I've got Sunday off. So, looking forward to it. Catch you guys later after our food. So right guys, uh, I've got water in this bowl. These are for the chips. So I'm going to put a touch of salt in here, like what they normally do in chip shops. That's about it. And uh, once I leave the chips soak, they don't go like a funny colour. So basically, they will help the chips cook properly. So let's get to it. This is my chippy, and you can watch me. So basically, I'm gonna cut this spud into chips. Oh, I've got the middle piece or not? I think I may have. I've got uh, the cutter, guys. So I'm gonna place it. I think it's like that, guys. So, it's washed, it's cleaned, uh, I'm going to wash the potato and I think, I'm, I don't know what it is, but I think I may do it like that and oh, It's done. Put it that way. <laughs> I think, yes, I've had that on the wrong way. Oh, silly me. Can you see these guys now? Wow, awesome. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave them soaking there. That 
was easy enough done guys so guys i've done the chips and they're all in here in the halogen the halogen light is on and it's cooking away and i've got sausages in there cooking away all is next is beans hey guys remember my top i think it's still up here it was £4.50 guys it was on a receipt i thought that i'd done a mistake but no it was £4.50 right on the bottom of that receipt that i had yesterday which was a tuesday awesome so i've done my chips i've got the beans in here so it's ready to dish out and the kids can go to bed after the tea so let's get tucking in it's a thursday the 14th and it's coming up to 10 past nine and i'm gonna head to work so i'll catch you guys late after work when kieran's here guys i don't know if you can see me but if i did the light on it's getting dark i got a huge headache i went vlogging yesterday because i was busy today i've got a day off of work tomorrow i got a day off of work and tuesday i'm going back in um in fact i got this headache that i don't like it's all in the front here um and yes we are going to a party soon so we're gonna get there uh the kids is gonna see santa but i will film from my phone uh, so i'm not well i don't want to take my phone uh camera i should say i don't want to take my camera so basically we're gonna have a good time and then later on tonight in church it's gonna be a nativity so we are gonna go back in church a second time i went in this morning we decorated uh um gingerbread uh biscuits little ones and we were dressing them as wise men so uh it was good to actually do that as part of a church uh that means quite a lot um so or some people in guys church uh in church so what we're gonna do now we are going to get ready to go to the party so catch you guys later hi guys it's a monday 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 so basically i want to show you something i haven't been on in quite a while well in a few days actually it's because i've been so busy with parties and everything so i will link the photos in this vlog so what i want to show you is what i purchased a couple of days ago so basically i've got this like merry christmas have yourself a merry christmas it says and i got this in card factory but it wasn't 3.99 it was down to around about three pound or something uh but it opens up like this guys oh something's fallen out of it so what i want to show you is what i got in the christmas eve box so far so the night before christmas coloring book this is amy's and santa's coloring book so both of them they can be actually colored in on christmas eve stuff but kids from getting on board because there's a long kind of day for them night i should say um i got highlights all right five sachets basically that will go in a christmas eve box i got something else too so i'm going to show you what i bought in the pound shop this morning so in this bag i got some stocking fillers and i'm gonna show you it's from poundland guys so here it goes 
first off I got this gingerbread decorating kit is uh, Christmas trees and uh, yes I bought them for a pound in the found land can't go wrong for that there's a couple of trees in there that uh, kids can do um, and yeah uh, the little baker so basically contains four gingerbread trees sugar coated decorations and vanilla ice icing what uh, the kids will enjoy this for decorating so i'm gonna get the kids to decorate this for thomas he loves hot wheels and i got a roll of toaster it's so cute it's got toast in there it's, it's a toaster but he can roll it possibly he can push the handle down but look at it guys this is his stocking filler Amy, she loves Barbie and into anything at all. And I've got a stocking filler of uh, Barbie. It's got a little dog guy, it's got a change of clothes for her and it's got a Barbie there. How cute is that? And she's got shoes on by the looks of it. So, yeah. So, yeah, this would be her stocking filler. So far, I've got chocolate money. Um... The silvers and golds. I think a golds will be to Amy and the silver will be for Thomas. So yes, these are gonna be the stocking fillers. Uh they were pound each, so basically uh yeah, I thought sometimes you could get smaller ones, but these were the only bigger ones that they've got in the pound shop. I got Thomas uh, Freddo faces, uh, he loves Freddo and I thought this would be good to go in his stocking. On to the Smarties, Amy loves Smarties and I thought this should be good to go in his stockings. It's got a pink lid, she loves pink. Um, but yeah, I'm going to pop it into her stocking. guys welcome i've got my toast here so i don't mind me eat dinner if i've got chocolate in my mouth now so we had a visitor of the children's presents because of miss x has arrived and i want to show you something some of amy's and some of thomas's I only wrapped Kieran's up as he's got some that we've bought too so that could be added to Kieran's and so on. So first up Amy's we got this trolls I bet Amy's gonna be in love with that. Also she's got a trolls cup and yes it says sparkle time. I don't know if you can see it. I'll show you it. Um, when Amy opens it in a day. I can't wait until a big day, of course. So, yeah. She's got cl glittery cap. Next, she got, she's got this cute owl. It's a plush, it is. But how stinking cute this is. It is lush. I love the eyes on there. Um, inside is um, it's a Paw Patrol and it's inside is three books four felt tip pens a poster and over uh, 50 stickers so she's going to actually enjoy this for Christmas she got this lovely cute carry bag with a unicorn in it and I think she's going to carry it everywhere she goes um Seriously, how cute is this, guys? Just how cute is it? Next, she's got Shopkins activity pack. Um, and it includes four colouring pencils and over 50 sweet scented stickers. So, yes, Shopkins... I think she most likely get into Shopkins when Wednesday, but yeah, she got Shop Shopkins activity pack. 
next up in her bag she had Dory. Um, she, it's a car, story book, colouring book, activity book, over 50 stickers, uh, two posters in one and four felt tip pens. So yes, she got Dory guys. You can't go wrong for these guys. 18 colours. Pencils. They're like school type ones. Do you remember the orange ones with pencils? But these are colouring pencils. These are lush. Um, so yes. 18 colouring pencils. Also it says paint your own purse. But it's got felted pens in there. So I really don't know. Bit confusing but... She can actually colour this person and keep her own purse as a, a thing. Look at that, guys. Right on one side. Picture on the other when she colours it in. Hopefully she'll colour it in quite well. To go with the colouring pencils, here's a jumbo colouring book. She's going to love this. Um, I'm going to flick through it. It's got lovely outlines of it. I think she's going to enjoy this. I haven't seen a book in my child days. I loved the colouring books. But these days, they are getting much more better. What do you think, guys? Comment below. Awesome, guys. You can see just how amazing that is. She got 555 sticker fun uh, princess places. Basically, if I can flick through it. She's got stickers everywhere. <laughs> and basically, she could play some. I think this would be good for Christmas Eve, actually, for her. She could play some anywhere in the pictures. And I love for her to do that. Uh, I know my mum's got uh, sticker pictures, books. Last but not least... Pencils, sharpener and pen. She may have this when she's older, but basically if she can keep it when she's older, perfect. It'd be time for school and proper pencil case and bag. So, yes, student set. Awesome or what, guys? Last but not least is a children's baking set. She loves baking. She had one bowl before with a jug and a whisk. She uh basically I don't know ah right here. Four times measuring spoons, ten times cookie cutters, one times measuring jug, uh one times mixing bowl, one times baking pan, one times spatula, one times whisk. So basically she's got she's gonna love that. She's gonna enjoy baking more with me. Next we're on to Thomas's and I'll show you what he's got for Christmas before I wrap him up. He's got this Hot Wheel cars. He loves his cars so much that he's got a Hot Wheels lorry too. So basically he's going to enjoy this for Christmas. How amazing is that? He's got some Play-Doh guys. We may get Amy Play-Doh as for her uh, Rainbow Dash but... Thomas has got his own and I'm pleased he's got his own so he can play with Play-Doh that is going to be Lush guys I don't know if you can see kids dough so yeah um, I don't know if you can see on the lids you've got these patterns of a lion and a rabbit and a cat and a butterfly I don't know what's that I think that's like a chick or something he's got this doll set it's like um you push your dough through and it makes patterns uh i might help him do that but yeah he's got dough uh play-doh set so that is awesome it's got everything like cutters in there um dough roller knife you name it it's all in there guys i think thomas would love this to carry everywhere with him, it's a fold away tyre playset. So basically, I can't wait for him to open this. 
Uh, it's got a car, I think, included. I'm not too sure. Maybe wrong, maybe right. It's three years plus. And basically, it's like this, guys. We'll have to show you on Christmas Day how it goes. And yes, he may take it every way. He may take it to my mum's. He may take it to his nan's. He may take it everywhere. I think it could be attached to this, actually. As you can take it anywhere that you like. Even on holiday. If we're going out on holiday, we may just take this with us. That he won't get too bored. Last but not least, coloured pencils. 12 of them. He loves colouring in. And, uh, yes, he just loves it. He likes drawing too. These are ideal for him. They are Crayola. Crayola Creola is quite a good brand. And, yes, these are colouring pencils for Thomas. Last but not least, I've got Thomas an urban streetcar. He's got um, a remote control in there. It's an infrared remote control. So, I want to see this car going, guys. <laughs> and I got it for six ninety nine in B&M. And it's three years plus. Awesome, I what, guys? So, yes. That's all today. Thank you for watching our um, mini haul. I have got a, a haul of you guys straight after this. So I'm going to show you straight after this uh, video that I'm going to end. But thank you so much for watching. I have got that suitcase right there, if you can see it. Yeah? And it's got all wrapped up presents in there that you can see on Christmas Day when the kids will open their presents. But trust me, I think the kids are going to enjoy Christmas this year. Um, meaning that they can enjoy this is what life is all upon. Enjoy as a family. Make it fun for the kids. But also yourself if you've got one another. That's great. So, on to the next haul. I went to... Um, where did I go? I went to the town to do some shopping to get some mini things before Christmas and I'll show you what's in my big bag. Guys, I want to show you something. This is was from B&M. So basically it's my shopping haul, the things I bought, like for last minute things. So, this caught my eye. It's gold. It's got stars on it, glittery stars. I don't know if you can see it, guys. That's a bit better. <laughs> um, and it's 4 99 it's a table runner, but what I want to do is to actually put a white sheet underneath, on top of the table, but underneath this runner. It's going to look amazing. It's going to throw it off quite well. So I'm going to use a white sheet just to go over the table to have Christmas dinner on, as my mum's coming over for Christmas. Um, so the next thing is panettone or something. I don't know how to pronounce it, but... It's a cake with currants and that in there. And I love it. Seriously. Um, people do different things with it. People toast them. Um, I don't know what does people normally do. Comment below what, what you do with yours. So yes, I got a small one and this was from Lidl's. Uh, Aldi's I should say. I've got three stockings here guys. Because... I need to actually do my mama stocking. Uh, that would be nice. So basically, I got a luxury stocking here for my niece. They're going to fill her stuff up in there, even presents. So basically, all her stuff will be in there given to her. Um, and I think she'll enjoy that anyway. Um, same with these two. I've picked these out on purpose because they're different and I've got different stockings downstairs. So basically this one's got a belt with it and this one's a knitted one and I think I love the knitted one. Seriously, that's, that caught my eye actually. It's in the pound shop in um, Poundland. So, awesome guys.
I just love the stocking. Next on your ginger, a uh, ginger two ninety nine. You can't go without crackers for Christmas, can you? Gold look lux. I don't know how to pronounce it, guys. But have you seen those things that's in there? Key rings, anything at all. I love that fish. It just bends, but we'll figure that out. Um, sharpeners, you name it. Everything's in a cracker. So that's perfect for this Christmas. You can't go without gift tags, as my husband may need some too. So... I'm actually going to go ahead with gift tags and I bought three and they were 50 pence each in the bag and buys. actually got Amy a pink kind of Disney wrapping paper from Aldi's. She got different ones here. As you can see, she got different wrapping paper compared with this. This will be in a stocking. And this will be on all her presents that are going to wrap up for her. So, yes. Um, I love wrapping, but give it, uh, like, uh, before Christmas and I'll be tired of wrapping. Most likely I'll be finished anyway, so. <laughs> I can't wait to finish. Right, I'm going to show you cups and they are going to be awesome. And I'm going to show you my sisters because you're going to enjoy it. Um. I'll show you the rest that me and me and my mum, anybody that comes over like Christmas and that, they can have some Christmas mugs and it's going to be nice. So guys, Lucky is not broken or anything because I bought some cups the other day and it says let us know. So it's a penguin. That's really cute guys. Got two let us knows. So basically, somebody can fight over which one they want. I never realised that I've got two penguins. A father Christmas one too. And it's green. And yes, that's all the mugs I got. But I'm not going to show you my sisters. As she could be possibly watching. Hi. So... Um, you'll have to guess that by yourself uh, when you open it on Christmas Day. So, um, and in here, I'm not going to show you, but it's a gift for my dad. Um, I like the sleek black of it. Um, I may tell you about winner. And it's got a necklace and a earring and he's going to enjoy this. So, basically, this is his gift. I'm not going to show you guys. But it's going to be awesome for him to open on Christmas Day. Hi guys, welcome. It's a Wednesday. And it is now... Nearly half past five. So, I'm going to do a Christmas cake. And this is going to be a surprise. As... My dad wants a Christmas cake, but I'm going to try you guys and see how it comes out. I'm following this recipe, guys. Um, it is um, busykitchen.com. I don't know what's the thing, but here it is, guys. You can watch a video. I've got the ingredients here, so I'm following steps. So now I've creamed the butter and the sugar together and it says add the eggs one at a time with a teaspoon of flour a tablespoon of flour beat the mixture well between each egg added so if I have a look up here it says I need four eggs I don't know if you can see it guys it's not focusing but there it is guys four eggs I wish this camera would focus but seriously I'm gonna add four egg eggs and um, yes in between each egg I need to add flour so here it goes <laughs> 